they look like so much fun. But just ask Logan Dean what he thinks about trampolines. Well, I think it's very important that people know what can happen if you don't properly use the trampoline. It can be very, very dangerous. He was 12 and goofing around on one with friends when he bounced and heard his ankle snap. By looking at it, it was crooked and on an angle. This is where the bone is broken. The injury was so severe that even when doctors tried to fix it, there were complications. His bones stopped growing properly. It took three surgeries over seven years to fix all the damage. I thought that, well, that seems like an injury that would happen from a lot of force uh, rather than something as seemingly uh, innocuous as a trampoline. A group of Canadian orthopedic doctors were seeing so many of these severe foot and ankle fractures with bones failing to heal that they published a study warning of so-called trampoline ankle. And doctors say most happen when more than one person is jumping on a trampoline. If they're out of sync with their bounces as the trampoline mat's coming up and another uh, child is coming down, it's essentially a solid surface at that point. It makes the mat harder than it looks. It's equivalent to them falling actually from a building. So doctors like the idea of regulations. And that'll be our word of warning is one child on a trampoline at the same time. But that requires constant supervision, whether in the backyard or at a trampoline park. So it's one reason why doctors put out their study and why Logan has put his ankle out as a pretty graphic alert. Most people think they're a toy and they kind of overlook um, the safety part of it. Overlooking something that seems fun, yet can be bone-breaking. Avis Favreau, CTV News, Toronto.